After another disappointing display by the top order batsman Michael Clark conceded that he might have to bat higher in the order. Dismal performance of the top order batting lineup of the Australian cricket team is one of the major reasons for this consecutive test defeats. Clark believes he might have to promote himself higher in the order to bring some stability in batting. I think I have no choice. Um, again, it hasn't been about me. It's about it's been about trying to do what's best for the team, and I think now, um, especially in these conditions, I have to bat higher. I've got nine days to work it out, wherever I can go and and put some runs on the board to help the team. Clark pointed that players have start working as a team to get anything out of the game. Well, it probably hasn't worked in these two test matches. It worked, it worked uh, against Sri Lanka and, and did pretty well against South Africa through the Australian summer. Um, again, I don't think picking your batting order, maybe I'm wrong, I've been wrong plenty of times before, but I don't think picking your batting order can revolve around one person. The, the team needs the team to play well. We need our top six batters to be scoring runs. We need or our four, five, six bowlers to be taking wickets. It can't be about one player or one person. Um, I've never played cricket that way and I don't want this team to, to go to that. I, I think we have enough talent. We've got to get better, every single one of us. You know, I'm, I would have liked some more runs in the first innings. I would have liked a lot more runs today in the second innings. So I've got work to do as well. So I, I don't want it to be about the individuals. I want it to be about the whole team improving. Terming the performance unacceptable, Clark has asked the players to up their playing standards as he believes the current form is nowhere near the Australian cricket criterion. Oh, who knows, they're all tough when you lose. Um, they're even tougher when you perform like that. So yeah, look, I don't want to compare it to any other day. I think at the end of the day, our performances in these two test matches, like I say, have been unacceptable. Uh, certainly nowhere near the standard that we're trying to set in the Australian cricket team. Um, there's plenty of people that not only watch us on TV, but fly around the world to, to support us and watch us, and we know we've let them down.